Uh oh. Uh, tab. Fuel for your lantern. So that, unfortunately, leaves or runs out a lot faster than I thought it did. Uh, I need lights. Ignite, ignite the candles. Ah. Alrighty. Let's go in the darker room. Ooh, that wasn't good for my sanity. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's check out what's going on. Yeah, I see what's going on, good sir. Well, you said you weren't gonna help me. Bye, Dolly. <laughs> Bye. Hopefully this is enjoy this is entertaining for you. Currently right now I I'm kind of just playing a game and talking to myself, so this is a weird This is weird. That's all I can say. But it's a weird thing to get used to. Ooh. 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Ah, so you was trapped. I guess there's some echo with the voiceovers. Um, I apologize, I, I don't know what to do about that. So, bear with me. Hopefully it's not too bad. Uh else is around here. Is there anything else in here? Alright, let's open up the door and continue moving forward. Hang out here. Catalogs. This might be useful. Or this was just... Oh, this was where I just was. Okay. That's right. Let's go this way then. I'm getting disoriented now, and that's not good. Uh, old tomes. Interesting. Oh, this is also where I just was. Wow, I cannot figure out where I'm going for the life of me. This is great. This is a great problem to be having right now. Have I gone in this room already? Oh, no, it's locked. Okay. Let's go ahead and light these candles then. Anything of note in here? No, of course not. And now we bounce. Why do I love horror so much? Uh, it's just because I, I like the psychological analysis of a lot of things. I'm kind of a nerd when it comes to that kind of thing, which is why I love Saw so much. Uh, the whole reason why... Uh, uh, why Jigsaw does what he does is because uh, he got a new lease on life with cancer and it made a his mental state very interesting. Uh, can I play the piano? Oh, I can't play the piano. Ooh, maybe? No. I can't play the piano. So sad. But yeah, I, I that's more so why I like it. Is because it... Uh... It's just interesting, and that's that's part of the reason why I like it. Is this a painting, or is this a map? That doesn't look like I can do anything with it, so... Oh, well. 
wasting my lantern oil because I can. Yeah, I'm. Uh, the lantern runs out much, much more so than it does in uh, Legend of Zelda: Twilight Princess. I don't know why I'm trying to jump on that. Ooh, what's in here? Ooh, a chest. I opened the chest. Ah, more lantern oil and more tinder boxes. Yay! Something is playing the piano. Ooh, I don't care for that. No, thank you. Flashback. Oh no, oh no, oh no, I'm blacking out. After pounding an unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. And grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. How odd. Somebody's playing the piano again. Stop playing my piano! If I can't play it, you can't either. Oh. Oh, that's... That's blocked off now. Okay. I shouldn't be wasting my lantern oil. But I have to. Maybe? Let's try to get these tinder boxes. Or torches, rather. Tinder box is what you use to light a torch, good sir. Hey! Take that. And get the bottom one. Yes, sir. Alrighty. Well, let's. Keep moving, I guess. That was weird. I don't really know what to unpack from that. Uh, I'm stuck. Ish. Unless. Oh. Okay. Into the hidden room we go. You have, you to, have be to be swift, swift when you activate, activate the first one. one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, that way. It's locked. Okay. Ah. Oh, more land around, please. Um. That seems suspicious. Maybe it's just the position I'm in. I can't move this now. I can pull it out, but I can't put it back in. How odd. Okay. A embarrassingly long amount of time later. This is tied to a door. Or can I not? Can I not move it anymore? That's tied to something. Which is also tied to this book. Let's try this book. Which is tied to this book. Which moves it! Yay, I figured it out! That took a little long... That was a little embarrassing with how long that took. Ah, but there's the key! Oh. I guess that moved the... Did that move the rocks? Guess only time will tell. Another note! 
Regarding closing of the wine cellar, Wilhelm and his fools have endangered my research log enough with their absent-minded handling of the human vessels. Uh-oh. The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the forest and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail to Brennenburg. I need to lock Willem and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave or they will starve. Whatever comes first, they can rot for all I care. Maybe I will feed them some wine. It would, in a sense, solve both of my problems. Interesting. I suppose it is an old castle. Perhaps I should expect more of those kinds of puzzles. Okay, but this is open now. And this brings us to a different area. Or is this the same area? Okay. Do we follow him? So it only makes sense that we follow him. We're gonna go ahead and fill up our, our lantern a little bit though, to be safe. Let's follow, let's follow the guy that was over here. Huh. Okay, we'll head back to the entrance hall. It was done, the men said. The tomb has been revealed. The Tin Heinen awaits Gurin to the Toothless Foreman. Oh. Oh. Okay, then. We're not going back that way, I guess. Well, that was the first time the, the game said, said no right in my face. <laughs> So to speak, it's good to know that it's uh, it's gonna uh, guide us towards the direction we need to go with that. So that's it's very good to know. Whoa, my vision does not like that. This is we already explored this area, so we need to find the wine cellar. I guess can we open the stadium? Did we explore this already? We did explore this already. I hear the piano being played again. Oh, I don't like it when people play the piano. It means there are people here. Or is it a ghost? The ghost of Brennenberg! Hmm. Well, I guess that the key was to the wine cellar. So that would make sense. So, bodily experiments on humans? in the wine cellar. Or did they lock up his men for the wine cellar? Oh, this is blocked off. I can't go that way. Oh my goodness. Oh. Okay. Okay. And the first jump scare got me. Awesome. Here I am talking about... Oh, there's another piano. I didn't notice that one. Doop, 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 doop. I'll keep going. Is this how it was laid out last time? I don't think I lit that door. Is this new? No, this is the same area I was in. Ah, I cannot keep myself. I am directionally challenged, apparently, because <laughs> I cannot figure out where I need to go. Can try going back to the entrance hall, I guess. Whew. Okay, so we can just go over it. Interesting. There's no stairs over here. So we'll gently go down it normally. It's like a red hue to everything now. Well, I guess let's discover. Let's see if there's anything down here. Refinery. It doesn't seem we can s 
still seems we can't go through this just yet. Well, I suppose next we should look for the wine cellar. I'm not the best at these kinds of games, but the funny thing is I'm very good at Zelda, so a different kind of puzzle game, so to speak. What's this way? Guess we never went this way, did we? Uh, laboratory. What's this way? The wine cellar. Need the key. And it is unlocked. And now we can go to the wine cellar. Alrighty. Time to see if there are some gentlemen in here waiting for us. Oh, flashback. Where did the tyrant go? Who cares? He has left it up wine to last us a lifetime. Or at least until tomorrow. <laughs> Alright. The lantern ran out of oil. sight and hide in the darkness. Make sure to turn off your lantern if possible. Okay. There's an enemy near? Is there a way to crouch? Ignoring what the game is telling me to do. That's not a good thing. Alright, let's explore. What's it? Oh my. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's not good. Oh, oh no. What's happening? Oh, feel, feel like. My chest is going to burst. Oh. My God, Wilhelm, do something! Except we're not getting out of here. How can you say that? Alexander, you piece of shit! Let us out of here! <laughs> Wilhelm's last words. My name is Wilhelm, House of Genrich. Or Genrich. I think it's Genrich. Uh, these are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I was summoned to the castle Brennenburg as most of the aristocracy. I was curious about what happened the night of the order could... Uh, what this supposed, supposed night of the order could want from me and accept the and accepted the invitation. Sorry, I can't read today. 
The Baron was friendly and offered me a proposition. It dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sordid and that the reason I was chosen was because of the follies of my past and not the horrors I've been rewarded with during my test at during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim and do so without asking questions. In return, he would attest to my character as the royal court, advancing my position within noble society. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly and I accepted wholeheartedly. Ever since that day, I've brought men, women, and children to Brennenburg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred, none of whom were ever seen or heard from again. Tonight, the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. I had my suspicion as we descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us in a toast. The wine tasted fine, and my and my men drank without restraint. So begins the punishment for our sins. The Baron has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I've done. I was weak and fell into his dip, uh, diabolic ways. My men... We're screaming. My men are screaming. Their skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides revolt against their God-given nature. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes, and I can no longer... There's a good chance that he passed away there. Well, as I slowly drift into... and lose my sanity because of all of the... Uh, oh, unfortunate gore that's around the place. I believe we are going to end this episode here. And end the stream here. Thank you for joining me for uh, my first taste of amnesia. Uh, apparently, I need to brush up on my puzzle skills because that book puzzle took way longer than it should have for me. And I'm kind of embarrassed about that. But hopefully, this wasn't uh, you all enjoyed that. Once again, this stream is more so going to be me with Gygus popping in and out uh, every now and then. Oh, there goes my lantern. Well, I suppose that'll be the game. For now, tune in next time to see what exactly happened to the rest of the men that were down here and what exactly is following me.